Congratulations are in order to the Philadelphia Eagles, which I picked correctly to win in my Super Bowl predictions video. Always said numerous times here, if you look back at my prior videos, I'm back and forth between Philly. I love Philly. It's like the second city to me. And then, then down goes the evil empire. Down goes the evil empire and the Patriots, you know, as a Dolphin fan. Hate the damn Patriots. Gotta give Philly its props, man. Crazy. Seriously. For you lifelong Eagle fans out there, just think about this for a minute, okay? A backup quarterback becomes a coach, gets hired by Reed as his OC, and brings back the quarterback Reed drafted to begin with. Both working together after the, uh, after the loss, arguably... The MVP in Wentz. Kid comes back to Philly, where he tore it up for crazy stats and guides the team to a Super Bowl win against Brady and Belichick and Foles. What he does. Second time around with Philly. Just let it all sink in. Peterson, good coach, great assistance. Maybe great coach with great assistance. But Harry Roseman, my boy, what a game. Chip Kelly who? Chip Kelly who? I uh, just want to, you got to thank Harry Roseman as well for drafting Brandon Graham and making that trade of Bradford, turning him into Derek Barnett, which were crucial strip and a fumble, recorder, uh, fumble recovery uh, late in the quarter in the fourth there. I go on record, I said I wanted Earl Thomas instead of Graham. I'm not very smart. It's crazy how history repeats itself. Last time this team uh, went 13-3, and you went to the Super Bowl in 2004. You also had to beat two teams to, uh, to get there, the Falcons and the Vikings. You won the NFC Championship and faced the, pa uh, the Patriots in a Super Bowl. You lost 24 to 21. Last night, history was repeated but rewritten. Fly, Eagles, fly. Fly. Fly, Eagles, fly. Um, just talking about that touchdown with Zach Ertz there late in the game. Uh, he and Collinsworth and the announced team, listen, my two cents there. Listen, I think exactly. He he broke the plane of the goal line after running three steps over the goal line. Collinsworth, come on. Uh, the best part of it, it seemed like he, like I think they really wanted the uh, the Patriots to win. Uh, the best part was hearing him go, oh, on the final play as the ball bounces out and incomplete. Oh, shucks, Collinsworth, right? Come on. I mean, and obviously, I'm just spoken fun here. I was so sick of listening him, listening to him by the end of the game. Listen, uh, Collinsworth to me just seemed a little bit Patriots happy. They said uh, during that point of the game that they were through talking about it. Come back from the commercial and had to pick the scab off and go right back to it anyway. During that presentation, again, again, 58-year drought has ended. The entire team deserves a lot of credit. And make no mistake about it, the game plan that they had against Brady, and I said this would be a... The game plan that they had, the game plan that I think Peterson had, obviously, was score. They need to score touchdowns, not field goals. They're going for touchdowns. That play uh, where Nick Foles, late in the second half, where Nick Foles catches it into a touchdown. Wow. Amazing. Amazing. They said that the Eagles would finish last in the division. They said Wentz would have a sophomore slump. They said Dallas would run away with the division. And they said 
All the playmakers would argue over playing time. They said the Eagles' schedule was weak. They said the Eagles were doomed once Wentz got injured. They said the Eagles were underdogs, even with the number one seed. They said Foles wasn't good enough to take over. Even I said that. I have my doubts. Could he repeat it again? They said the Vikings would destroy Foles. They said the defense couldn't stop the Falcons. They said that the Patriots would be too much for the Eagles to overcome. And leaving you, I say congratulations to the champions of Super Bowl 52, the Philadelphia Eagles. I hope all is well. Look forward to speaking to you guys very, very soon.